very special day for hundreds of student athletes as they sign national letters of intent to play college sports. And the Bluff City was well represented as you'll see in this story from ABC 24's Caleb Hilliard. Hey Caleb. Hey Richard, and as we all know, National Signing Day, a day with a lot of hats, a lot of tears, and a lot of speeches. Overall, it's a sacred day for student athletes to announce where they will learn and grow for the next four years. And less than 6% of high school football players go on to play at the next level. So the fact that we had so many Memphians signed to play college ball says a lot about high school athletics in the city of Memphis. 16 from Germantown, 11 from Raleigh, Egypt, 9 from Lausanne, 13 from Whitehaven, 5 from Oak Haven, and 5 from Southwind. And that is just to name a few schools. I'll be signing to continue my academic and my college and uh, my football journey at Rose College. The day started out with an unexpected decision. Germantown quarterback Cordero Walker had multiple Division I offers, but decided to stay in Memphis and attend Rhodes College on a full ride. Schools all over the nation wanted me, uh, but I felt Rhodes was just the perfect spot for me. One of many emotional decisions today. From Bethel University to the University of Memphis, these young men have put in the work, and now they get to reap the benefits. Like Claws and standout, Tyler Wilson, the running back slash linebacker, signed with Tennessee Tech today. Um, I felt the love, and I feel like Tennessee Tech is a place where I can continue my career and continue my legacy. Christian Brothers defensive lineman Will French, who is headed to Memphis. And another defensive standout, Cordova linebacker Xavier Green, who signed to play for Midlands University. Throughout the day, you could feel the love from the parents and role models who helped mold these young men into who they are today. In Memphis, My son is up. I'm Caleb Hilliard.